Chemical engineering was first established as a profession more than a century ago and has grown to span a diverse range of industries. As the Institution of Chemical Engineering celebrates its centenary, we look at the evolution of the sector and its place in society today. Chemical engineers help to create the world we live in, from life-saving medical equipment to the screen you're watching this film on, and even the adhesive on the humble post-it note. The Institution of Chemical Engineers, ICHEME, was established in 1922. In that time, the world of chemical engineering has changed, from just transforming raw materials into useful products, to designing, constructing and managing complex processes that help to solve the global grand challenges. Chemical engineering has helped to save and improve millions of lives. In 1928, penicillin was discovered, but by 1940, there was still only enough for a few people. It took chemical engineers to scale up, and by 1945, over 640 billion doses per year were being produced. Today, this ability to take something in the lab and produce it for the masses quickly and cheaply helped in the momentous task of delivering COVID-19 vaccines globally. But it's not just about going big. In the future, chemical engineers will help to engineer medicines to be personal to each patient. Chemical engineers look at the full picture. Energy, food, water and climate change are all connected. In the early 20th century, chemical engineers were at the heart of the extraction, refining and distribution of fossil fuels, fueling prosperity and revolutionising transport for everyone. But now their focus is in the transition towards net zero by 2050. Renewable energy and hydrogen are two of the answers. The problem is the batteries and fuel cells needed to store and use the clean energy require finite metals and minerals. Chemical engineers are at the forefront of developing ways to store energy sustainably. At the turn of the 20th century, the bulk manufacture of ammonia to produce ammonium nitrate and urea revolutionised the amount of fertiliser that could be made. Half the world's population is fed due to this breakthrough. But food production is intensive and emits CO2. Chemical engineers are playing an increasing role in making agriculture and many industries more carbon neutral. And clean water is essential for life. The chemical treatment of wastewater has helped to eliminate or reduce many diseases. But water is set to become a scarce resource in many parts of the world. Take biofuels, a low carbon alternative to fossil fuels, but it can take 10,000 times more water to make it. Chemical engineers need to reduce demand of water for agriculture and manufacturing. Tackling climate change is embedded in the thinking and design of new products and processes, from small modular nuclear reactors made on a production line to plastic that recycles multiple times and then eventually biodegrades. Chemical engineers are at the forefront of a circular economy, helping to solve the major global issues of today and tomorrow. <laughs>